Hey guys, what's going on? It's Undead Prodigy, and today I'd like to talk about some pretty big news. Over on Twitter, Charlie Intel released a update that Gamefly has actually listed a PS4 version of Modern Warfare by itself on their website, and they have confirmed that it has a June 20th release date. Now, this is good news for those who really will not do have anything to do with infinite warfare um such as my cousin he's not really big into the futuristic call of duties so this is good for him i think it's going to be listed for forty dollars as i have seen on amazon they already have a digital download listing for the ps4 it's kind of a uh, vague right now just because it's a new release I'm guessing and uh, Modern Warfare Remastered will probably have a lot more people playing it when this game is actually sold separately which I think they should have done from the beginning uh, I feel like Modern Warfare Remastered would have had a lot stronger of a launch and as you can see I don't have the best gameplay here um, you're going to see a lot of people just sitting around pitching a tent. And this was a game I recorded early this morning. Just kind of a regular TDM as normal people. Normal matches. Sorry, I'm, I'm kind of scrambled with my brain as far as commentaries goes. I've been studying for exams for about eight hours straight so anyways in news to that uh, I heard some very sad news yesterday one of my uh, friends alpha on YouTube he's a great youtuber he makes awesome montages and I thought I'd give him a bit of a shout out and I'd, I'm gonna post the link to his channel in the description but he makes some great montages Unfortunately, he is choosing to leave YouTube and pursue other things, and I wish the best of luck to him. Um, Toxic Chimp and Forstrom, they're other good YouTube channels that I have uh, listed as my related channels in my uh, channel feed. So if you're ever looking for new content, different content that everyone else has, Go check out the channels I have posted on my YouTube channel, and I think you'll enjoy them probably more than you'll enjoy me, to be quite honest. And let's see, we've uh, heard news that Black Ops 3 Chronicles, if that's what it's going to be called, uh, DLC 5, new Black Ops 3 game in a whole, definitive edition, whatever you want to call it. It has actually gotten an ESRB rating, which is very interesting because unless games are 100% confirmed and real, they don't generally get ratings by the ESRB network, network, community, business, whatever you want to call it. But so we may actually see a DLC 5 for Black Ops 3, and that would be just amazing to me because you know you've seen how much black ops 3 i've actually posted on this channel i've loved the dlc season they've had and it's just it's really cool to see if we actually get remastered zombie maps uh origins i have a video coming up later um it actually ended up i built one staff my first ever staff and somehow it escalated into me building all four staffs, which is amazing. I just could not get over how excited I was about that. I built all the staffs by around 14 or 15. I can't remember exactly. But it was just a really, really cool, exciting feeling. Because me and Origins, we've never got along. We've been like cat and dog. I've never done well at Origins. Uh, I think my highest round before the other day actually was 15 
and I actually just bumped that up to 30 with two downs because I don't I don't like buying revive consecutively um, I never really played much of origins when it released but I've really started to get into it so that could be one of the maps coming back to black ops 3 which would be really awesome I mean origins is a great map it offers a great challenge now how the challenge will work it kind of depends if you run gobble gums or not if you're running perkaholics and double points and all those mega gobble gums it's going to be way too easy probably um i mean if it does come out as dlc5 i will play it and i'm probably gonna still play it without gobble gums uh it'll be interesting to see you know how uh, zombie blood and in plain sight maybe they'll be uh, removing zombie blood in place of in plain sight because they're pretty much the same thing just one's a power up and one is a gobble gum you get I think you get it right off the bat if I remember correctly and in this game on back lot there's just camper after camper just pitching a tent it got pretty annoying for a while but I stayed strong and I try not to rage quit even if we're losing this badly they're 20 kills ahead and modern warfare is a great game but I'm not quite sure if it's my game I do enjoy it but uh, I do have issues with how many campers that are in it it really does get annoying getting fragged getting flashed almost 24 7 uh, I like the fluidity of the game if that's a you know let's go ahead and replace that with momentum this game just flows really well to be honest uh, I'm not gonna sit here and rant about oh I hate modern warfare remastered cuz I, I don't it's uh, not one of my favorite games I could take a Treyarch game over it but it is a very well put together game this is kinda what started the COD revolution or uh, COD Outbreak um, most people started in Call of Duty 4 because they revised it so much uh, compared to 1, 2, and 3 and I haven't beat the campaign yet I haven't posted campaign gameplays because I've posted campaign gameplays before and they'll either get no views or one view so I don't see what the point in uploading it is and uh, if you play the modern warfare campaign on hardened you will get spammed with grenades like you do in multiplayer it's it's a little bit rage inducing sometimes so I hope you all enjoyed this commentary uh, check out alpha's channel down in the description I think you'll really enjoy his montages and make sure to drop drop a like drop a comment subscribe if you want and leave me feedback I'm always open to feedback so this has been pretty much a wrap up on my thoughts on DLC 5 Chronicles uh, Modern Warfare Remastered coming out by itself and just everything in general what I think about Modern Warfare Remastered. I hope you all enjoy and you all have a great day.